Hey, good morning. It's uh, good to see you all out there for truly a historic occasion. Today's opening of the Armarchy Connector represents a substantial improvement in Floyd County's transportation network. Be a uh, just a great opportunity to relieve some traffic congestion that we have out here. When we have a uh, traffic bottleneck on 27, this will be an alternate route to allow traffic to flow through, and especially for emergency uh, responders to get through. Uh, if it's locked up on 27, there's no way to get around, and this provide an access for them to respond to an emergency. It's a wonderful project, and the, the best part about this is it's funded entirely locally uh, by the 2006 SPLOS. So the, the citizens of Roman Floyd County have certainly made um, an investment in, in our community and proved that um, they are really ready for uh, progress and for progress to continue in our community. It's very important because because sometimes uh, Highway 27 gets so clogged up in the morning and this is just going to be an alternate route uh, making it easier for commuters and a much uh, needed project for Roman Floyd County. So the project itself is a 2.2 mile connector that runs from this point right here and curves up around past Three Mile Road, crosses Old Dalton Road and curves back into Highway 27. The, uh, the Three Mile Road intersection is not signalized but we do have traffic signals at Old Dalton Road and Highway 27. There are two bridges, most notably this one crossing Ustanala, and this is a big deal for Roman Floyd County to get another river crossing. I'll echo Chairman Bagwell's comments. We also have a second bridge slightly to the north to control some of the drainage in that area. The northern section of the road, if some of y'all remember the genesis of this project, is meant to, cur to go to the east and ultimately connect to 53. So we've got some future engineering to do there. That would be a huge connection for the community. And I think a really great feature of this that didn't take that much extra effort was a dedicated uh, pedestrian and bike lane on both sides of the road that extend the full length of the road. You can see that we have uh, a, an extra wide uh, pedestrian and, and uh, sidewalk here. We've got a dedicated bike lane on this side and you'll see that for the whole extent. And that's sort of a commitment that the city and county have towards our future road projects to add to our trail system when we can.